What is up, YouTube? Never to go relevant. Back here with another PUA, the pickup artist video. And in today's date, no, in today's video, two days for you guys. As always, make sure if you do enjoy these videos to smash the like button and subscribe if you haven't already or if you're um, someone new. We do videos like this every day with two dates. Um, so, yeah, you know, hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video. And like the video if you enjoy it. But anyways, without further ado, let's get right into it. So today, guys, I've picked Luke. Hello. 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 You guys know about this video. You know how it was, went down with Rhea. So we got to figure out what's going on with that. Hi. So let's just get right into it. Tap ass. Rhea has invited you to Tapas Restaurant, where the food is not the only thing being shared. Okay. Very interesting. Rhea has invited you along to a tapas restaurant for a date. After everything that's happened between you two so far, this seems relatively normal. You arrive just in your finest attire and speak to the greeter. Greeter. Hello, sir. Name? Kev. There's nobody booked with that name, sir. Do you have another name? Yes, Rhea Silver. Ah, yes, Miss Silver. Table for eight. This Eight? This way, please. Hold on, table for eight. The greeter looks at the booking. Real silver, 8 p.m., eight guests. Yes, that is correct. This way, please. You are confused as this is supposed to be a date for just the two of you, right? Regardless, you follow the greeter to your table. When you arrive, Rhea is sitting with six other people, including Marianne. Marianne, that sounds familiar. Rhea stands up to greet you. Rhea, there he is, my little performer. She kisses you. Hello, everyone. You seem surprised to see us. Oh, yeah, that's Marianne. I may have neglected to tell him you were coming. You're not disappointed, are you? No, no, not at all. Well, I'm glad to hear it. You take a seat next to Rhea. Kev, this is Ulrich and Imogen, Polly, and Ryland. She gestures at the two couples. And, of course, Marianne, who we've met. Yes, we have. And her partner, Eric. Eric does a meek little wave at you. Everyone, this is my partner, Kev. Hey, nice to meet you all. Everyone greets you pleasantly. Or it's partner, you say. I didn't realize you two were official. Yes, indeed. We're very much in love, aren't we? Of course. Polly, how sweet. Rhea seems to have moved your relationship forwards without your knowledge. The conversation changes as the starters and drinks arrive. But soon, the table begins to discuss children. I personally cannot stand the idea of children. I'll grind him down eventually. Yes, we haven't discussed it yet, but I think we both want them, don't we, Kev? We haven't discussed it yet. We haven't, but I think I know. How I, the table laughs. I don't think he has a choice. Oh, wait. Oops. Well, I'll certainly have plenty of opportunity to force the issue, given that he's moving in next week. You don't remember having this conversation. You ignore Rhea's comments and the evening continues. Later on, Rhea excuses herself to visit the bathroom. You decide to get up and follow her. Be right back, everyone. Just visiting the restroom. There's only one bathroom in here, you know. Oh, I think he knows. <laughs> the table laughs. They all think you're going to have sex with Rhea. You catch up and see her. You catch up to her and see Rhea waiting in line for the only bathroom. Come to join me, have you, cheeky boy? No, I've come to talk about tonight. What do you mean? What's this talk of babies and moving in? I thought we discussed it. I have it. Oh, I must be mistaken. Though. Rhea gives you a wry smile. She knows she's messing with you. Don't you want to move in with me? Not yet. It's too early. Don't be silly. It's fine. One or two nights a week at first. Yes, that makes sense. The bathroom becomes vacant and Rhea enters. I'd invite you in, but I genuinely need to pee. Rhea closes the door and immediately you feel someone's hands on your thighs. Marianne, I bet. It's, I knew it. It's Marianne. You never called. Did you want me to? Would I have given you my number if I didn't? What about Eric? He's the starter. I need a man force. Marianne has her hands all over you when Rhea exits the bathroom. Um, I told her to stop. It's not how it looks. Alright. Oh, there Real smiles. There's nothing wrong with sharing, Kev. Real walks away. 
Have you accidentally saw, joined some weird village sex cult? It certainly appears that way. And what is going on with Rhea? Why is she trying to force you into committing to her with one hand and pushing you into the arms of Marianne with the other? Something odd is definitely going on here, and we haven't even dealt with him yet. That is so weird. Okay, well, I think that's all of her days for now. Oh, no, we can unlock another one, too. Okay, well, I, I just got to see where this story goes. I know you guys are probably... Oh, hello. I just got to see where it goes. Uh, now on to Lucy. Hello. Lazy lovers, your casual relationship with Lucy has been tense lately. If things are to continue, you'll need to find a way for both of you to work. Yes, indeed. You and Lucy are sat staring into your drinks and not really talking. Mm, you're quiet. Shall we go some someplace else? You're quiet. You too. Fair enough. Yeah, but we've been here too much, I think. Shall we change the scenery? Where? I mean, wherever we feels we are feels awkward. We don't really talk much anymore. Oh, we don't? I just want to relax with you somewhere. Why don't we just take the pressure off? Wait, no. Go back. It does feel quite formal being out on a date. I just want to relax with you somewhere. I want that too. Okay. Let's go to my place, veg out, and watch some Netflix. No chill, just Netflix. I don't know, maybe. You can finally see my place. If it's awkward, we can call it a night. If it's awkward, we can call it a night. But what will we watch? Whatever you wanted to watch for a while. What show do you think we'd both like? I like this new show called Killers of History. It's so funny. That's not going to make me feel comfortable at your place. You might be one of those. Okay, well. What have you wanted to watch for a while? There was this weird documentary I saw about cheese. Made me think of you. I'm up for that. Let's do it. Great. We should buy cheese on the way. You and Lucy head back to your place and relax on the sofa. You buy cheese on the way home. The documentary is quite interesting. You feel relaxed. Maybe it wasn't the conversation that was missing. Maybe it was just this. Puts her arm around you. Lucy puts her arm around you. Cuddle her and kiss her on the cheek. This is nice. I feel like we did early on. I missed this since we agreed to be casual. Casual can mean what we want it to mean. We should do this more often. Totally down for that. We're almost a normal couple. All we need is takeout and pajamas. <laughs> I'll get the pajamas you choose to take out. You don't know how happy you just made me. You fetch two pairs of pajamas and Lucy orders takeout. Half an hour later, you're snuggling and eating Chinese food while watching trashy TV. You look good in, in my pajamas. You look good in my pajamas. You should wear them to work. Ha, <laughs> maybe I will. Dang, I forgot a while about work. Probably better go soon. It'd be a shame if we fell asleep here. I can drive you home in the morning. Let me know when you want to go. It'd be a shame if we, if we fell asleep here. Pretend y'all and lie back and call Lucy. No, I'll fall asleep. All right. Lucy does fall asleep in your arms, and by the time you both wake up, it's the morning. When Lucy wakes up, the sight of your disheveled appearance is enough to make Lucy jump you. Who knew she was into morning? Uh, sex. You drive her to work the next day and all seems well. However, casual your arrangement is, you still need some semblance of familiarity if you want things to go somewhere. Slapping out with takeout and pajamas made Lucy instantly feel comfy, and this meant that she could feel sexual in your presence too. No. I feel like that went fairly well. But yeah, guys, that's all we have for today. Like I said, if you did enjoy, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe if you're new so you never miss a video. Or if you watch my videos and you haven't subscribed yet, just go ahead and, you know, click that sub button. It helps me out a lot. We're, we're, we're aiming for a 1,000 subs. Aiming for a 1,000 subs. But with that being said, guys, that's all we have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and I'll see you in the next one, which should be tomorrow's video. Uh, I don't know because it is Thanksgiving, but I'll try to post. Um, so yeah, I might do three dates.
in tomorrow's video, actually. Just because it's Thanksgiving. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.